Hey loves, it's Christy Love. Today I'm going to be bringing you a video called What's on My Nightstand. I ran across this video, somebody did it last year, and I thought, oh, that'd be a neat um, video to do. So here I am. I'm not going to be on camera because I'm not looking or feeling my best today. And not that I'm that vain that I think I need to look or feel my best in order to do a video. However, some days it's a down day and I'm just chilling. I'm not even really dressed today. But anyway, let's get right into what I have. So um, this is my nightstand. It does have three drawers on it and this is on my side of the bed. So I have a candle there. Um, this is my latest candle purchase, French Vanilla. Um, and you're just looking out into my backyard. Maybe I should go out into my backyard just a little bit. Yeah, so that's kind of like my neighborhood. But anyway, um, so I have a candle here. <clears throat> then I have a um, coaster because I like to take water or something to sleep with me. And then my phone is there chilling on the kickstand as usual. And then let me pan over here. This is me and my husband on our... Uh, last vacation to Hawaii. I have a couple of books there. Um, I like to read like a self-help book or something like that um, before I go to sleep because if it's a novel, honey, I'll never go to sleep, okay? And I guess maybe the reason why this video caught my attention is because I picked up this little uh, tray here. It's regular $20 at Target and I got it on clearance for just like $5 dollars and some change. I'm not really sure the exact price, but anyway, so let me tell you what I have in my basket. So I have there some Dr. Scholl's for her overnight foot cream. Now let me tell you the story behind me and a foot cream. So when I was pregnant and I guess your skin stretches or something like that, I mean, every night I needed like a massage to get to sleep on my feet. They were just itchy and dry and I don't know and my son is like seven years old and I'm telling you this tradition has continued I need to rub my feet or my legs or something every night in order to fall asleep so I just can't break that bad habit um so I got that and I think I got that in a gift set or something like that I'm not really sure but anyway I have some biofreeze because from time to time my back hurts and I can't go to sleep okay I'm not giving away all my old lady treats <laughs> But anyway, so BioFreeze, you know, it kind of freezes it. And I don't know, for whatever reason, it helps me go to sleep. So I just get that chill by my nightstand. I have the Bible, which is the first thing I probably should have focused on. Um, you know, if you want to pick it up and read a scripture. And uh, that's a notepad and a pen. I just got it from my last hotel stay. I like to grab everything that they say I can have that comes with my room and take it with me, especially the mini size toiletries. I love those in my overnight bag. Um, then I have some, this is the Sleep Mist Pillow Mist Lavender Vanilla from Bath & Body Works. That helps me sleep too. I normally have to take melatonin or something, but I haven't had melatonin in at least two or three weeks. I've just been using my sleep mist, so I guess that is pretty good. Then I have some Luxus Paw Paw Cream. Um, I got that in a swap box from someone in Australia. She said it was like a cult favorite there, and I just use it for my cuticles. She said you can use it for your lips. I haven't tried it for my lips yet. Then I have um, some Rosy Lips by Vaseline. I just love this little cute little tube here. And I have some floss, just in case, ooh, just in case a girl forgets to floss before bedtime. So that's what's chilling in my nightstand. Now, in the video that I saw, I think her name was Melissa Raymond. She does like a Friday favorites and possible poo, and I love her. Um, she's from the South, so maybe that's why I'm drawn to her. I'm not really sure. She went into her drawers and showed you guys what was in there. Uh, no, I won't be going into my drawers. Anyway, in my top drawer is like a lot of junk. Uh, that is like the lost files, the Bermuda Triangle. Uh, everything just gets tossed in there the second drawer has like journals and notebooks in there from like stories I've written and things like that so if I feel inspired while I'm in the bed I'll just grab one and start writing and then the last one has um things like my head scarves and some like extra socks in case I get cold just any of those little things like that that you need at bedtime so I know this video is just like focusing on one thing and I'm just rambling and running my mouth but I just wanted to bring you guys something I thought this was a cute little setup and it wasn't uh too much but anyway um I hope you loves have a great afternoon thank you so much for watching it's Christy Love Bye bye